Good morning guys, welcome to What I Eat Wednesday, a bit of change of scenery for this morning. I'm over at my mom's house, um, I took Tripsy with me last night, <laughs> and then I have Sabrina there and just spent the night here in Dan's at my house looking after Molly and Chloe. Um, so I've been looking around my mom's kitchen what there is to eat for breakfast, and I came up with half of a pretzel bun. Now I tried making these at home and it wasn't that good, but the main thing was I couldn't get this dark color on the pretzel bun um, and it didn't taste this good <laughs> anyways but it was a new recipe that I tried so I thought it would just I don't know come so I'll have to do more research but maybe if you guys know with these pretzel buns that have like the dark cover coloring what makes it that is it like a wash that you put on top or is it the type of flour you use or because I boil them before as normal pretzels as I found out boil them in water and baking soda so just more baking soda or I don't know mmm these are so good so who wants to go for a walk girls I'm gonna go take them for a walk and enjoy my um bed and then when I get home my mom has a lot of teas so I'm going to um choose a tea to drink all right so I'm back from our walk and I'm gonna have some tea I've because I love David's tea, the loose tea leaves, and so I've gotten my mom and my sister onto loving them as well. So my mom has actually the, I think, sleepy time, but then also the sweet indulgence pack. So I am having this one, oh, chocolate orange. So what do they say about it? Delicious puer blend has it all. Okay, I don't know how to say that. Bake chocolate curls to satisfy your dessert craving and zesty orange peel for a trust to touch of fruitiness and spice. It's the kind of thing you could get used to. Mm. So I'm just having it brew in there. Mm, it does smell good. <laughs> and then just going to relax and prep some for work, hang out with the dogs, and I'll touch base with you guys a little later. Okay, I changed my mind. I made it into somewhat of a latte. <laughs> so I put whipped cream on it. Mm. And then sprinkled a little bit of um, just plain dark cocoa powder on top. <laughs> All right, but now I'm going to enjoy it. Well, I originally wanted almond milk or soy milk or any kind of milk. They didn't have that, so, or they didn't, my mom didn't have that, so, but she has whipped cream, so I'm like, eh, it'll eventually, like, melt, and then it will be like having milk, but I guess that's what I'm having. <laughs> so I am home again now, just getting ready to go to work, but also having lunch here, because I know all the food items that I have in the fridge. Um, so we are making omelets. So, ooh, what is this spice blend that you added, Sir Dan? Paprika, chili spice, and oregano. Cool. And then we have onions, garlic, and my $2.50 red pepper. Or <laughs> part of it. <laughs> ooh, look at the pretty color. Although Dan was disappointed. He said that it was too dark, but I think it looks really nice. Huh. That's very pretty, so mm, it smells good too. So that's going to be my lunch, and then I'll choose a tea to drink because I am so excited on my 24 days of tea, David's tea, but, and that starts, it's the advent calendar, it starts on December 1st, but I said that I have to finish five packages. I have like the little sachets of my loose teas before I'm allowed to open one, the first one on December 1st. So I have a lot to go through, which is good, but I'm also drinking more tea than coffee as well. So yes, yeah, so that's my, my plan. So anyways, first you're having this and then I'll show you what tea I decided to drink for work. So my tea of choice is the Strawberry Fields tea from David C. It has a really nice light um, fragrance. It's not too heavy and it's yeah, not like chai tea or anything. Anyways, so it's just finishing steeping and then I'm about to go to work. <laughs> so I'm home from teaching and just before I go to dance, I have a banana with some almond, almond butter and just as a little pick-me-up snack between this because I am quite hungry. So, um, yeah, and then, oh, it's dripping and dogs are getting it. Ah. <laughs> Anyways, um, and then I'll just heat up some leftovers after for dinner. So I'm home from dance now and heating up some leftovers, just some leftover stir fry, and then on the bottom you can see it has um, 
quinoa and brown rice. So yeah, it was just a frozen stir fry mix with lots of sauces. I made it on Sunday and had three big containers of leftovers. So perfect for when it's 8.45 and you need to eat dinner. So I'm going to drink some more tea today. This one is the Silk Road Tea Philosopher's Brew. It's a herbal tea. I'm not having caffeine or anything right before bed. So I'm just gonna brew some tea and edit and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.